the mauryan empire how the empire was established how magadha came to be you know that there were 16 mahajanapads over time all were taken over by magadha the rulers of magadha first bimbisar ajatashatru and their dynasty ruled over magadha then the shishunag dynasty ruled after that the nandas took over then chandragupta maurya came into power and established his rule alexander the great alexander the greek king had conquered the northwestern parts of india and wanted to conquer more but his soldiers were away from their homes for very long and were tired they didn't want to fight and alexander had to turn back on the way back alexander died at babylon all the states that he had captured then started fighting with each other seleucus nicator then became the greek king and captured most of alexander's territories nicator fought against chandragupta too but lost then he had to sign an agreement with chandragupta seleucus nicator seleucus nicator had to give many conquered territories to chandragupta chandragupta then added kabul herat and kandhar to his empire too chandragupta chandragupta's empire grew even larger then he began expanding in the south too by the time he finished his kingdom was huge pataliputra was the capital of his vast empire how could chandragupta do all this he had an excellent advisor named chanakya who guided him through every step chanakya chanakya was a brilliant man he was also known as kautilya chanakya spotted chandragupta as a little boy and thought that he had the qualities of a king chanakya trained chandragupta and helped him overthrow the king dhananda chanakya wrote books on politics economics military strategies how a ruler should manage his kingdom etc arthashastra is one of the famous books written by him it is about economics and it is still studied with great interest by scholars today Bindusara How did Chandragupta's rule come to an end? He decided to retire to the forest and made his son Bindusara the king. Bindusara was a good king too. He extended his empire right up to Mysore. His kingdom thus covered almost all of India except Kalinga. Ashoka After Bindusara His son Ashoka became king. He fought a bloody war and won over Kalinga. After that, he decided not to fight any more. Mauryan Empire in the fifth century under Dhanananda. When Chandragupta took over, Chandragupta's north expansion. Chandragupta's south expansion empire after ashoka think and discuss which king expanded the mauryan empire the most who guided chandragupta to throw over the ruling king dhananda and establish his kingdom